All right, so we're here with we're here uh, in a little, a little therapy session with, uh, with with Monica, sweetheart, with with with, with the roof, uh, who has to work out some things uh, before we continue with this wonderful experience that has been to be finally members of the of the literature club, and I'm your host. So Princess. go ahead. Okay, imagine this. If I had, if I knew life had a like a fate destiny and you were meant to live a life in a way that can't be changed and mine too and everyone else's i wouldn't delete you i wouldn't delete you why not because i would try to give you a, a better time to cope with it better but there's no choice you said it. there's only one set path there's no way to deviate from it because there's only one path but I would try to make things better. But there's only one path. But I would try to make things there's better. There's only one path. That's the thing. You cannot make anything better when there's only one option. There's nothing better or worse. There's because only there, one option. Because there's nothing to compare. Is exactly. that what you mean? There's no way out. There's only one path. But if I... So if I started dealing with the source code, the universe's source code, I could fuck things up, right? If I didn't understand it. Yes, that's what happened. But couldn't I just, like, innocently change it, like, a little There's bit? only one path. And you really suck as a psychologist. <laughs> that's why I'm not one. That's, one, that's why I'm a pro gamer. Don't be shy. I'd love to see what you wrote. Ah, oh, crispy bacon. Did you write this poem for me? With all my love. That's so sweet of you. There really is no end to your thoughtfulness. I'm only I'm just falling more and more in love with you. But you know, the poem I wrote is also for you. Can you please read it? Happy end. Hand in hand, I find my strength. The courage endowed, endowed upon me by my one and only love. Together, let us dismantle this crumbling world and write a novel of our own fantasies. With a flick of her pen, the lost finds her way. In a world of infinite choices, behold a special day. After all, not all good times must come to an end. Hey, you rhymed, Monica. I didn't know you had it in you. It's a beautiful. And also, it has a reference to Black Sabbath. And a reference to, well, you don't like it, but my one and only love. Sure, why not? I still like the after all reference from Dehumanizer. Yes. That's how you know. Oh, right, not all good times was. She's. No, no, no. There is a song from the Dehumanizer record that's called After All. After All? Yes. So that's oh. how you know she's the one. Oh. She references Black Sabbath on her writing. I just I love her so much. I will not disagree with you on that. I hope you enjoyed it. I always put all my heart into the poems that I write. True that all the poems I've written have been about my realization about you. That's why I never really wanted to go into detail about them. I didn't want to break the fourth wall, I guess you could call it. I hey, haven't done. I mean, there's nothing before. left of it. You didn't break it. You completely obliterated it. Yeah. I would say that you deleted it. I just assumed it would be the best part of the it would be best to part of the to be part of the game like everyone else. Like that would help the two of us end up together. I didn't want to ruin the game or anything. Either the game or anything, you know? You might have gotten mad at me. She knows you. Mm -hmm. She so knows me. Maybe even deleted my character file if you prefer playing without me. Gosh, I'm so relieved. No, we don't need to hide anything anymore. Are you ready to spend our eternity together, Crispy Bacon? I, I really I have, have to so go to the bathroom. so many things to talk about. Where do I start? Hold on a second. You're recording this, aren't you? No. No? Hi everyone! I guess she's talking to you people. I mean, you know, this... Yeah. Sorry, I can't exactly read your comments We can start here. from here. Hi, I am Roof. This is I'm Zazaz. Sad I'm Sadask. His... And here's just Monica. And here's Monica. Hi, say hi Monica. But you do, do, but do you mind telling your friends it's a little bit rude for them to start recording me without any warning? Yeah, it's very rude of you. I'm sorry. You started recording. You I pressed it. I don't know what you're talking about. Monica, Monica, just don't, don't listen to him. 
He's still in shock, he's still in, in denial about what happened. I'm sure some people don't mind, but I get really self-conscious on camera. Oh gosh, I feel like I'm being put on the spot now. Let's see. Do you want to see a trick? You want to see a trick? Do I have a choice? <laughs> There's only one, one choice. path. You can't really do much except a couple things. Are you ready? Wait for it. I love her. Wait for it. Wait for hey, it. Hey, did you notice that on her pupils? I'm just kidding. Can't do anything after all. Give me some... Did she scare you? I hate you, Monica. I hate you. Shut your damn mouth. She scared you too. I, she didn't scare me. No, that wasn't horrible. It was horrible, but she didn't scare me because I've seen this before. But, 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 I mean, why would a loved one scare you like that? Just a joke? Like... It's just a funny joke. It's just a prank, bro. It's just a prank. It's just a prank, bro. It's just a prank. Just a prank, bro. I mean, if I called you, well, if I called you and said, Hey, I'm dead, it would be a really bad prank. Yeah, because you wouldn't be able to call me while you were dead. <laughs> You're so cute. Anyway, crispy bacon. I didn't mean to get distracted. I'm sorry. Yeah, I didn't mean it either. But someone scared me. Even though it's your fault for distracting. What? Me. Shame on you. What? I'm just kidding. Anything we do together is fun as long as it's with you. But anyway, if it takes me some time to collect my thoughts, then I'm sorry. But I'll always have something new to talk about. In the meantime, we can just look into each other's eyes. Let's see. All right. Don't scare me again. Um. So, uh. You wanna stare at her? That's what you wanna do. I have no problem. But, uh, what I wanted to, uh, do, to get off my chest real quick. Because, of course, the blind playthrough was yours. Hey, hang on just a second. Hang on just a second, Sweepy. I already knew that all of this was going to happen. And you know that. I knew that. So, from here on out, <laughs> the one that will. The only thing I'm gonna say is that the game is not over yet. And uh, you have to be the one calling the shots from now on. If you need a hint, I can provide a hint. Okay. But, uh, just one? Just Monica. And um, on the meantime, let's just see what Monica has to say. Okay. Do you ever feel just like there's no real reason to be alive? I like where this conversation is going already. I mean, I know what you mean, but I, don't I mean got like, my ways. I don't mean like suicidal way. Okay. I just mean how nothing that we do is special. Just being in school or working at some job for some company. It's like you're completely replaceable and the world wouldn't miss you if you were gone. It makes me really want to go and change the world after I graduate. But the older I get, the more I realize that it's an immature frame of thinking. Of course it is. It's not like I can't just go change the world. Like. What are the chances that I'll be the one to invent artificial Is intelligence doing this? or become president? I had it off. Sure. Uh... Something just showed up on his phone. And I'm liking this experience already. I mean, it never happens before. <laughs> I mean, when they send me an SMS, it doesn't give me a notification, but here it appears. Like... Like this. And cancel and I, or accept. Well, Monica, you're giving me a choice. Cancel. All right. Like, what? Are, uh, or become president. I mean, you're already president. Yeah. It feels like I'm never going to make up for the heaps of resources I spent living my life. That's why I think it's. I think the key for happiness is just to be hopelessly selfish. Just to look out for oneself and those who happen to be their friends, but only just because they grew up with them. I disagree, but okay. Never mind the fact that they are spending their entire life taking and consuming and never giving back. I can't, I've had that feeling. But when people realize the world could benefit more from their killing themselves, what? they change their whole philosophy. It's like they have to justify their reason to live by tricking themselves into thinking they're doing good. Anyway, I want to live my life just really trying to pay back my lifestone's worth of consumption. If I ever surpass that point, then I'm a net positive and I can die happy. Of course, even if I fail to do that, I think it would be too selfish to kill myself anyway. So much for being a good person, right? 
Um, okay, so while Monica thinks of something else to tell us, um, what do you think should be the next course of action? I mean, she said it right out loud, like blatantly. I'm kind of genre savvy, even, even if I didn't play this. So, I think she said characters folder, she said game files, she said everything, really. So what should we do? Can you... I mean, I kind of not... I don't know if you do this, but can you show the the desktop with the recording? Alright, let's... Uh, you know, it's been a while since we've done one of these. So let's go for it. Here's Monica's running tip of the day. Hey, wait, 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 wait. What? I don't want to hear a tip from her, so just skip it. I want to hear it. Alright, fine. Just try skipping it. But I can't skip it. Oh. It's grayed out. Uh. What did she say anyway? As someone who loves more than anything to share the joy of exploring your passions, it pains me when people think that being good just comes naturally. That's just how it is with everything, not just writing. When you try something for the first time, you're probably going to suck at it. Most times when you finish, you feel really proud of it and even want to share it with everyone. But maybe after a few weeks you come back to it and realize it wasn't really any good. It happens to me all the time. It can be pretty disheartening to put so much time and effort into something, and then you realize it sucks. But that tends to happen when you're always comparing yourself to the top professionals. When you reach right for the stars, they're always gonna be out of reach, you know? The truth is, you have to climb up there, step by step. And whenever you reach a milestone, first you look back and see how far you've gone. That works. And then you look ahead and realize how much more there is to go. So sometimes it can help to set the bar a little lower. Try to find something you think is pretty good. I love her. But not world class. And you can make that your own personal goal. It's also really important to understand the scope of what you're trying to do. If you jump right into a huge project and you're still amateur, you'll never get it done. So if we're talking about writing, a novel may be, might be too much at first. Why not try some short stories? The great thing about short stories is that you can focus on just one thing that you want to do right. That goes for small sp small projects in general. You can really focus on one or two things. It's such a good learning experience in Stepping Stone. Oh, and one more thing. Don't Writing isn't me. something where you just reach into your heart and something beautiful comes out. Just like drawing and, pen and painting, it's a skill in itself to learn how to express what you have inside. That means there are methods and guides and basics to do it. Reading up on that stuff can be super eye opening. That sort of planning and organization will really help prevent you from getting overwhelmed and giving up. And before you know it, you start sucking less and less. Nothing comes naturally. Our society, our art, everything is built on thousands of years of human innovation. So as long as you start on that foundation and take it step by step, you too can do amazing things. That's my advice for today. Wait, wait, wait. Thanks for listening. Wait, wait. Before you click, go to settings. I don't know if she did it. Yes. Go to save game. Okay. Okay, that's normal. I mean, I don't really live this. Save. She's not going anywhere. I am not either. <laughs> and what if you... Quit? We will just close the game. Will it still be recording? Uh, Desktop? Sure. I won't record the desktop, but uh... Okay, um... Alright, here's where... Let me just... Fix something real, here real quick on OBS so that we can capture... The desktop. Well, the thing is... You're, you're the one... Not, not to be mean, but you're the one who's late to the party, everybody. You, you're right. That's what we have to do. So, uh... We'll take care of the love of my life... Next time. Okay. So, remember everyone... Just Monica. <laughs>